back with Neil Cavuto. I want to ask you, what is it like being in the same room with Bill Clinton after all these years? Not easy. Not easy. And how close are you with some of the other women who are part of the press conference tonight? Juanita and Paul and I are close. I just met Kathy Shelton tonight. I've gotten you no know, other women who've been assaulted and almost raped and, and raped by Bill Clinton. They are still afraid to come forward. I've gotten to know them well. And how important is it to you to be a part of this election so many years after your alleged assault took place? I came here for one reason. One reason is to point out that these, these are not infidelities that the mainstream media wants to, us to all think they are. Sexual assault, rapes, and sexual harassment are not infidelities, period. They are crimes and they are felonies. Hillary Clinton is a fake feminist. A champion of, wo of women does not attack the victims of sexual assault and rapes. All right, what do you say to people who say that this is old news, that no one cares about these stories anymore? I don't think it is old news. I don't think it is. Maybe his affairs, his consensual affairs, I'm sorry, are old, are old news, but I don't think this is old news at all. I mean, these are important issues. These are women's issues today. Younger women, the millennials, are paying a whole lot more attention to this than they did before. When I was growing up, when I was young, it was men will be men, deal with it. Young women today don't put up with it. And a lot of them do not, were too young, or not yet born when all this happened, and I think it's important that they hear these stories. What do you think about coming here? And now the scrum is.